Hey everybody, happy, um, I believe today's Thursday. Yes, it is Thursday. Happy Thursday. Um, today we are going to do a double unboxing of witchy subscription boxes. Um, first we're going to do Tamed Wild for May. This does indeed come in a mailing bag, so you, they don't have to put like the mailing sticker anywhere on it. I took the bag off. And then um, we're also going to do one called the Texas Witch Box. This one comes not in a mailing bag. They do put your uh, mailing label on the back here. And then it opens up here. Um, so anyway, I think first we're going to start with this. I am going to link the information for all of them below as well. Both of them, not all of them. Um, and so, yeah, let's see what's in here. Tamed Wild is a monthly subscription box. Um, it is $20 a month uh, with $5 shipping. So they charge you just $25 right off the bat. Um, and so this romper is like, I should not wear rompers, first of all, because they don't work for me, but okay. So they, every month do give you the cards. Um, these cards have rituals on them as well as ritual tools, as well as different things that are inside of the box. They're usually back and front today. Uh, this time we have three of them. Oops. And I think I'm holding it upside down. No, no, I'm not. Good. Okay. That one. And then, yeah, as we kind of go through the items, though, I will read off what each of them is and what each of them does. I won't necessarily read the rituals because that might take us all day, which we do not want. So I'm going to start with what's in this little bag. What's really fun is that when they have small things like this to give you, they do give you a bag that is by them, by the company. And I think that's interesting. Ooh, okay. So it's two clear quartz points. I like that. That's really, that's interesting. And here, this one's like, you can see where it broke off, like here. Oh, this one too. Um, I'm going to see what they say about clear quartz. If they have it here. They sure do. Okay. Yes. Um, begin the ritual by charging the clear quartz crystals with intention. When the crystals are aligned with the desired frequency, use them to activate the rose water ingredients. Okay. So there's stuff in here to make rose water. But anyway... Um, you can also use them to recharge um, the potion and the rose water. Okay, so let's, 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 let's see what they have here as far as the potion goes. All right, so yeah, okay. For the ritual, we're going to need all this stuff here. You have the rose petals. Sometimes they'll send us a tea of the month. This time, no, they just sent us the rose petals so that we could make the uh, potion. And as well as the bottle. And it says here you put the rose petals, water, and an intention in here. Um, oh, okay. Okay, okay. For a simple rose water recipe, add what's in the uh, bag to a saucepan and simmer with one cup of distilled water until the flowers have lost their color. So that's approximately five to 10 minutes. And then remove the pan from heat cover and let sit until it is cooled. Filter out the plant material with a cheesecloth or strainer. Okay. Pour the potion into the bottle right here. And then you put this sticker on it so you know what it is. Um, you can add witch hazel or essential oils. Huh. Okay. That I, okay. I did not know the recipe for rose water but all right well there is that particular item or items we also have this little amulet piece it's a bow and arrow oh my gosh it's so tiny i'm sorry see that there um they don't give you a chain to put it on but i have many and this is supposed to represent artemis okay um i'm not i'm not gonna read the whole description here because it's extremely long but basically, um, when we wear this, we honor all guardian spirits. If we feel drawn to work with Artemis, we ask that 
this amulet shield us from violence and uphold our independence and safely guide us through the darkest parts of the forest. Okay, so that's that little guy right there. It's really pretty. They give us a lot of little things like this. And then also that too comes in a little teeny tiny bag. I have so many of these tamed wild bags. I should actually probably like give some away. Okay, anyway, next. <laughs> so excited. Okay. They have given us canvas tote bags in the past, and I love all of them. Here is this month's. I think that the patterns on here are beautiful. I really love it. There's a lot of, here. They're also really spacious. Like, you can fit quite a lot in here. I have another one by them as well that it's white though and they've given us that a while back so I like don't use that one frequently mainly because I'm afraid to you know get it dirty but this one's black so I should have a more difficult time dirtying this one if not an impossible time and let me see if they said anything yeah tote bag I mean you know take the tote bag with you on your next outdoor adventure I'm use it as a carry-all for ritual tools okay farmer's market finds or whatever speaks to you during your next um foraging trip okay very nice since going places now is a little bit more acceptable okay ashley's confused no i'm not confused i'm not confused parchment restock your ritual toolkit with 12 new pieces of parchment okay the pages are excellent for recording your spells or signals before tucking them into your grimoire or your book of shadows. Okay, great. Or burning or burying them. Okay. For like intention work. Ah. I'm not a graceful person by any means now. I'm about as graceful as a cow trying to walk on Vaseline, but that's fine. That's my sister's line. I don't know where she got that from, but anyhow. Um, the parchment, yeah, I mean, it is really just nice and thick. They're all about this size. Um, they're all exactly the same size, actually. So that's good to have for any spells or intentions. I think that's kind of cool. So that's everything that came in our first box, Tamed Wild. Um, we have our cards. We had our whole rose water uh potion making kit here we had our first little drawstring bag I'm kidding <laughs> um their amulet I know I showed you the stones first but anyway the second one with our clear quartz point stones super cute our restocked parchment paper and our really cute tote bag that I can possibly get less dirty than the last one. So that was everything from Tamed Wild. I am going to link them below. You can choose to buy the monthly subscription box like I do, or you don't have to do that. You can just go onto their website and buy things individually they offer that as well um, again the box itself is only twenty dollars plus five dollars shipping so 25 a month it's worth it and you can pause it or uh, cancel it at any time and again i'm gonna link them below check them out and the next thing we're gonna do is our texas witch box all right here we go um the texas witch box is also 25 dollars a month I, and I believe that also includes the shipping because I don't get charged any extra for the shipping. Um, this one's a little bit different. You get, instead of the three or four cards, you just get one. It tells you like what could be in the box. Um, I just realized that not all of these items will be in every box because um, it's six to eight items. And this is the small box. So it's six to eight items. Okay. And we're going to start with the stone, the agate stone. It's tiny. See, these nails sometimes are just not functional. That's really cool. Um, let's see. It's for healing and knowledge, they said. 
there's that. It's really pretty. The light. Just the light a little bit on it. Okay. Oh. Um, a charcoal disc. I, I was confused as to why the charcoal disc is in here, but I think this is, oh, you can burn incense or flowers or resin. Okay. Oh, 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 okay. So there's that. And then I thought this was a cute touch. Um, they are a small business and it says, thank you for supporting my small business. So that's really neat. This one is, yeah, it's a smaller type box. So, um, are there flowers in here? Yes, there are. I believe that's what this is. The whole Colin Duo flowers. They're best used for transformation spells, spiritual communication, protection, magic, and beauty. I believe that that's what this is. I believe it is. Um, let's see. Oh, the rosemary wax melts. Well, you guys know what wax melts are for. These are the scented ones where you like break off the pieces here. And this though has yeah, stones in it. So damn. Okay. So like, yeah, there's like three, I think, different stones inside here. So when you, as you break it, you'll probably get these stones out of there. And I use these all the time. That. Um. Oh, the spell bottle. Yeah. Oh. So I suppose that this is like a love potion type thing. That's really cool. They put it so how in the last box they just gave us the tools to make something. This one they actually gave it to us. Um, let's see. Oh, it's for healing spells. Okay. Oh, I like that. I think we have it has red rose petals, wild cherry bark orange peel I guess yeah I guess okay I see that okay wonderful so there's that little piece there um what's this oh uh, okay Guys, I thought this was chocolate. This is not chocolate. Hold, okay. It comes in this, it does smell like chocolate though, in this wrapping here. Um, let me see. Hmm, yeah, this is a tea. So this is, you put this in your cup as a tea. This is Flower Pot Tea Company Blooming Tea Flower. Okay, yes, that's that's cool. That's really cool. So I don't know, this is really neat. This is a bonus item. So I think that's cool. I'm gonna rewrap it because I just should. Really cool. Um, then they do always give you herbs. I don't know exactly if anybody could tell me that would be great. I don't know what that is. is it rose? No, it's not rosemary. Um, lavender. Lavender. It's lavender, guys. It's lavender. How I just noticed when I held it up to the light here. I don't know if you could see. And it turns purple. Like, do you see the purple? It's the lavender. Okay. Lavender buds. Yeah. Um, it can ease anxiety, stress, and depression. Yes, it can. Okay, that's, and then you can use the charcoal disc. That's kind of why they gave us the charcoal disc then. You can burn this on there. So, yeah. This one is a slightly um, smaller box. Um, comes with different things than the Tamed Wild box does. But actually, both are really great. Both are really cute. I just didn't want to do two separate videos because especially for this one, it's kind of um, would have been a shorter video. Um, again, this is the Texas Witch box. It is by Kay's Magic. This is the small box. She does have other options as well. So you can check out her website. I'm going to link that below. And I really enjoyed hanging out with you guys today. So thank you so much for being here. I am going to see you guys on the next video, which I'm going to record tonight in my jammies. That's going to be fun. 
And that one is going to be the Curse of Chucky reaction video. So we did the Seed of Chucky last week, which was kind of a funnier, more upbeat one. And the Curse of Chucky is not funny at all. So be prepared for that. And yeah, we're going to have more unboxings. Fab Fit Fun will be here soon. Um, the Ipsy uh, will be here pretty soon as well. So we'll do that. And that's the Ipsy X or something like that, where it's a bigger box. Yeah. So anyway, we have a lot of good stuff coming up. I hope you guys have a great weekend and I will see you guys tomorrow.